So today I am currently developing a cold and I apologize for my hair situation right now and I also apologize in advance for the weird things that I might say because my brain is currently turning into a ball of soup bowl bowl of soup my brain is currently turning into a bowl of soup aka I'm super sabao right now and that is because it is 1.59 a.m. and you might be asking Janina why are you filming at 1.59 a.m. it's because I want to keep up with my mission to create a video for you guys every week and if that requires me staying up all night then I will do it because I want to complete my mission and before we get on with the video guys can you please talk about how cute my scarf is because it looks like a watermelon in scarf form and its seeds are heart shaped and I just find that so cute because food is awesome and scarves are awesome too so put them together and what have you got? Bippity boppity boo! I need coffee. Okay so I got me some coffee. Mm -mm. Okay, honestly my Daiso experience wasn't the best. It it was really bad. Um, there were boxes everywhere. There were boxes in the aisles, there were boxes in the entrance, there were boxes in front of the merchandise, and I got elbowed in my stomach, in my face, I got run over by carts, I ran over people with carts, and I ended up not using my cart at all and just lugging around my basket because I kept pulling merchandise off of the shelves because the, the aisles were just too small, they were too narrow because of the boxes, and it just... It was not a pleasant experience at all but I could say that it was worth it because guys 88 pesos per item I'm sold the first four items that I got were highly recommended by different bloggers and different youtubers so those were the items that I ran for as, a, as soon as I entered the store and we will start with those so let us start with my Daiso haul let's do that again in a more dainty and ladylike fashion. Let's go ahead and start my Daiso haul. This is my plastic bag filled with Daiso items. The first thing that I got is a is something that I will not be able to tell you the real name of because I do not read Japanese. But I will make up a name for you guys because that's how much I love you. It is a charcoal pore minimizing mask. Oh yes, that sounds official enough, so we will call it that. Formulated with the natural ingredients from oak trees, it removes oils and all dirt and deeply cleans the pores, leaving your skin clear with less visible pores. Basically, this is a pore strip in liquid form. You get a small amount on your on your fingertips and you rub it or on your nose and anywhere else that you might have um, pores or white heads and after 10 to 15 minutes it will dry and you can pull it off and supposedly your white heads will come along with it and it will also minimize your pores and I don't know about you but my pores are pretty big and that's such a weird thing to say yeah the next thing that I got is cleansing foam honestly when I saw this I thought this was for the face but it's actually for the whole body which I have no problem with but um, yeah this is cleansing foam it makes your skin more smooth and beautiful how to use make bubbles with water softly massage and wash out seems easy enough I think I can do it so yeah smelling test first it smells clean I don't know if that makes sense but it smells clean I don't know about you guys but there is a smell when something is clean let me know if you too smell the clean smell so that I don't look like a complete weirdo up here cuz I swear this smells clean anyway next product I got a body scrub there's just something about body scrubs that I love so much. Um, this one is a rose scented body scrub. I don't know, I just like the feeling of the little particles on your skin. I don't, I don't know, it's just a thing, a Janina thing. And it really smells like roses, you guys. So if you love rose scented things and you love scrubs, definitely you have to get this. 
I love the packaging because it's pink and it has roses on it and I love pink so yes that is that next product <laughs> um, the last beauty item that I got is eyelash fix which is a falsies glue um, I've used this before so I can tell you straight up that this works and it's really good it starts off white and as it dries it turns clear so you know you should buy this and it's definitely worth your money 88 pesos yes <laughs> the next few items are the items that I found on my adventure in Daiso and I did have to battle some carts and some people but it was worth it <laughs> so I'll show you guys first thing that I got well actually it's not the first thing but the first thing that I will show you are these super super cute wooden clothes pins that have a floral pattern on them I I actually had or have the mint green ones but when I bought those last year, that was um, that set, that particular set was the last one in stock, so I was not able to get more. So when I saw these in stock, of course I had to get some, and they're just pink and they're floral and they're awesome. So that's that. Yes. The next thing that I got is also pink and floral and awesome. It is a tray. You may be asking me, Janina, why did you buy a tray? And Right now, I am also thinking, why did I buy a tray? It's just so cute, okay? It's adorable and it's plastic so I can't break it and that's awesome because I break things a lot. Um, so this is just like a striped pattern with pink floral on it and um, yeah, this is what you call an impulse buy, guys. And if you know me or if you, know, if you ask any of my friends, they will tell you that I'm not an impulsive buyer but there's just something about Japanese stores that just bring out the inner shopaholic in me and I just buy these things that I never knew I needed but I do, you know? So, apparently I needed this tray. It actually had a matching blue version of this but the wise Janina in me was just knocking inside of me and telling me, Janina, you do not need another tray which is so true because I already have two trays in my room and they uh, and I'm only using one so I have an extra one just in case you know <laughs> okay next item is an iPhone case so I got this really cute glittery one this one is silver and it has little um, round gems on it and behind that there there's um glitter can we just talk about how I did not mess up my wing my wing eyeliner today yes Wing eyeliner on point today. Wing eyeliner game strong. Yeah. So next item, a folder. There are tests and quizzes currently cluttering my desk because if you didn't know, I am homeschooled. So after I do a test and if my mom has not checked it yet, I will leave it on my desk and they will just pile up, which is what they're doing now. So I needed something to cutify that little clutter there and I found the perfect thing. It has elephant patterns and there are hearts on it and I just find them so adorable. So also there are other items with the same pattern so you guys should definitely check that out because they're so cute guys, I swear. Okay, the next thing that I got, I got it because I needed it. Hallelujah, I actually did something right. I lost mine so I got scissors and basically scissors cut things and this is a mint green version of scissors so I got those yes next I got this thing that you usually see at Ikea and I wanted to buy them when I went to Hong Kong but I was running low on the Mon Mons and there was no more space in my luggage so I was so excited when I when I saw them here yay a scarf hanging thing a scarf holder and now that I look at it in the camera it reminds me of the thing that was choking the fat penguin in Happy Feet uh, if you remember the, the one that people would give the stones to yeah that penguin I, it looks like that comment down below if you know what I'm talking about so I don't look like a weirdo talking about a movie that nobody knows please do that back to the school supplies correction tape pink rabbit correction tape correction tape 
any pink rabbit holder. Pink rabbits are cute, except when they come out of their mother's womb and they're hairless. I usually write in pen, if not all the time, I always write in pen. So I make a lot of mistakes, I'm sorry, I'm human, I make mistakes. I need somebody to correct me and that is where my pink rabbit comes in. I got this organizer, um, this organizer in which I am losing the dividers. Oh, there it is. I can demonstrate it to you. There are dividers that you can just put inside and it just looks super swag. And I love the rose detailing all around it. Um, I think it looks really pretty and it's white. And give me a high five, a virtual high five, if, if you need some organization in your life just like me. High five, yes. I need some organization in my life and this will help me, so I'm all for that. <laughs> and last thing that I got was actually for my bae. When I say bae, I mean my dog because my dog is literally my bae. Her name is Bay. She had just worn out her bowls, so I needed to get her new ones. And these are just these really cute porcelain ones with hearts on them and dogs on it on them. And it says, hug the pet. So, yeah, I... I would say that I'm really excited to use these, but I won't. So I'm really excited to let my dog use these. Yes. So that is all for my haul. I'm sorry if I was super sub out today, but it is, I think, 2.30 by now. Yeah, it's 2.30. And I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. Um, please give it a thumbs up as always. Also comment down below for your requests. Nothing new, but I just really love um, knowing what you guys would want to see from me. Bye guys, I hope you have a wonderful day and may the wings of your eyeliner always be even. <laughs>